ここからは私のターンだ。Hey guys, k a r i x f u t i here with another review. This time I'll be reviewing the Gosei Header series Leon Laser from Tenso Sentai Gosei here. This is the weapon used by Gosei Knight and includes three things the Leon Laser, Vulcan Header, and one Gosei card. Start off by looking at the Leon Laser. Like the Leon Cellular, it is mauled after a lion. With a, though this one has a big open mouth right here. You got the eyes, the nose, this whole big part being the mane, and the little crest on the top. Plus, a little m o l d i n on ears. And you've got the handle here, and on the other side, we see all the screw holes. It's black plastic with silver, with silver, gold, and red paint for the most part. And then we have this little bit which is red plastic with a little bit of gold paint. Next, we have the Vulcan header, m o l d e d after a lion's head, like the rest of Ghost in Eight's arsenal. And it's also kind of、uh, combined with a Gatling gun. With these eight barrels around the side and one in the middle. It's also black plastic but with a lot more red paint, with some metallic red paint, as well as gold paint and green paint. And third. Is the card, the Vulcan header card, the, I mean, the Knight Dynamic card. <laughs> so, as you can see, we have the Gosei mark upside down, which there is a reason for that. You got the Gosei mark in the corner, the number code, and on the back, you have the number code again, and yeah, again, an upside down Gosei mark, which will come into play later. And dynamic along the side. So, starting up, we can switch on with the on off switch right here in the back. And there will be a light coming from the trigger in the handle. Okay, so here is the Leon laser. It has a gun blasting sound like this. Pulling down the trigger doesn't do anything. But you do kind of hear a little bit of lion's roar mixed in there. And we can change it to its other mode. First, by pressing down this button, and moving down this part, and locking it into place there. It's going to. It's going to give you the sounds clearly. First, you. Press down this and move this part down until it locks into place here. And take this part, press down this, move that up and extend out the blade. And there you have the Leon Laser Sword. So in this mode, it also has a single sound. And you also hear a little bit of lions roar in there too, which is nice. Then you can convert back by just doing the whole reverse thing. And now it's back at the absolutely on laser. And to get that sound for the Leon laser sword, you can just press down this little button right here. The next step we have is combining this with Leon Cellular to become the dynamic Leon Laser. So I'm just going to grab a certain card for a more effective, a better effect, and let's start this off. Gotcha! Leon Cellular Seto! 
Parkan Heda Kalo. Balkan Heda Seto. Naito Dynamic Cardo. Danzai no Nightic Power. And there you go, that was uh, basically a recreation of what Jose Knight does in the show to perform his finisher attack, Knight Dynamic. Now I'll just show you that step by step. So first off, you take the Leon Cellular with it open like this. And it can open to two points here and here. But Jose Knight only ever have it has it open to this point. So the first step you do is you take the Leon cellular and attach it to this part here by sliding it on vertically. And then to complete the dynamic Leon laser, you take the Vulcan header and attach it to the front like this. And then it activates the tribe sound, the Nitic power sound. Since Nitic isn't exactly a tribe, but it has its own little tune, like Sky, Klanic, and Seek. And like that, you have the completed Dynamic Leon Laser, which is really big. And actually does look pretty cool. Then you take the Knight Dynamic card and slide it into the Leon Cellular. And so here we have the Gose Mark right side up, and it's also on the back where it shines through. Where it shows through with the screen. The card activation goes like I showed before. The number combination. And the night dynamic sound is completely separate, which you get by pressing the trigger when the Vulcan hair is attached. And you have that. Of course, with the right timing, you can do what I did. And there you have that. I guess something I should have mentioned earlier is that while as the Leon layers are sword. Ghost Knight can perform its special attack, Knight Metallic. And uh, just to show you how the activation for the go the dynamic Leon laser works, you have this little notch that is pressed down when you attach the Vulcan header that presses up this switch, which hits this button. Just like that. So basically, you can activate Night Dynamic sound without even having the Vulcan header on. And as far as headers go, it has a notch that'll work for the on the Gosei Blaster and basically makes it a Landic 
header. So it makes the landic sound on the Gussie Blaster if you attach it to it. Of course, you can attach any header to this port, and it'll work the same way. And you also have these two release levers here on the side, which also make it easier to put on the Vulcan header. So, in conclusion, the Leon Laser is a really cool weapon. I like it a lot. It is a, it does complement the Leon Laser, and you should probably get if you have the Leon Laser. I mean, the Leon Laser complements the Leon Cellular. That's what I meant to say before, yeah. It's a really cool weapon. I mean, of course it has a short blade, but... What do you expect from toy swords, especially ones that convert from guns? The Vulcan hair is really awesome. The card is nice, and you know, combining the two is really awesome. Doing the whole night dynamic thing. I mean, I definitely recommend both Leon Cellular and Leon Laser to anybody who likes Ghost Hay Night. They're really awesome, separate and even better as a set. And even to, even better together as a set. So, please rate, comment, subscribe, and check out my blog at krx50.blogspot.com. And for now, this is krx50 writing off.